In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to change your background color in Notion. Currently, you can't change the background color of an entire page. What you can do is just change the background color of your text or blocks. Usually, when you want to go to the next line, you just press enter on your keyboard. Then, you hover on the left side of the beginning of the text, click the six dots, then color, then choose a background color. But as you can see, there is a visible white space separating them. And if you highlight everything and change the color at once, the outcome is still the same. There's a way to get rid of that white space, and that's to place these texts in a single block. To do that, enter your text normally, but before pressing enter to go to the next line, press and hold shift, then enter. So it's not just enter, it's shift and enter. Now hover on the left at the beginning of the first line of text and click the six dots. This will select all three lines. They now belong to a single block. So when you change the background color, there's no more white space. You can also try something else like putting your text inside a toggle list or a callout. This also works for databases, unlike the first one. Let me show you. Let me create a database first by pressing the slash key followed by DA. Then inline database. Time to create a callout. Press the slash key followed by CA, then click callout. Then, hover on the top left corner of the database, then drag and drop the six dots inside the callout. The blue horizontal line should be inside the callout. And to change the color, hover on the top left corner of the callout, click the six dots, go to color, then pick a color. You can also turn it into a toggle list. Click the six dots on the top left corner of the callout again, go to turn into, and pick toggle list. This is nice because you can choose to hide it and unhide it. That's it! If this video helped, don't forget to hit like and subscribe.